Hey everybody, what's up, what's poppin', what's good, and welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel. Um, for today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how I apply my lashes, specifically 25mm lashes. Um, I thought it was only fitting since I have my own lash line that I make a video on how to apply lashes, and I can also put this video on my um, lash page in Instagram. So I was like, why not? Let's make the video. Um, <clears throat> so I'm gonna give y'all like tips and tricks on how I apply my lashes. A lot of people do it differently. Some people do it the same way. It's just, it kind of depends. This is just one way you could do it. Just, you got to kind of find the way that works for you. Because I try like two different ways before I start doing it this way. But this way is like the way that works for me. So, um, for today's video, I'm going to show you guys what glue I use, how I apply the lashes, what lashes I wear, all that type of stuff. So, first, I'm going to get into the These are the two types of glues right here that I mainly use. The duo glue. They're both duo. This one is different because the glue, oh, stutter. This glue right here, it dries clear and it also has an applicator. Y'all, I can't open it. Girl, I'm gonna need a, what's that thing called? Oh, I think I got it. I got it. All right, so this right here, it has an applicator. If you can see, it has the applicator. Um, this is the reason, this is the first ever glue I ever used for lashes. This is the main reason why I wanted this glue because it has an applicator. I highly suggest this glue for somebody that's just starting off putting on lashes. They don't wear them that much. They just want, um, something easy to use. Highly recommend. It draws clear so it's easier just in case you mess up as a new, um, lash applier that it, if the glue gets on your eyelid, you can't see it because it's black. It's not black, it's clear. So I highly recommend this for somebody that's just starting out. I think it's about, matter of fact, I'm not going to say the price. I'm just going to put it on the screen because I'm going to have to look it up. But I had this glue since, I want to say I had this glue for about, I want to say four to six months. I'm not sure. But this glue does last a long time. And then right here, we have the other dual lash glue right here. Um, This one does not come with an applicator and this one dries black. It comes like in a tube like this, you got to squeeze out. By the way, my tube is messed up because when I first bought it, it didn't want to squeeze out, so I cut it. So, mine comes out a lot. So, I have to use a little brush sometimes. But I gotten so used to how much it comes out that I stopped using the brush. But this one right here, it comes in the white and pink package. Dries black, doesn't have an applicator. I suggest this one for more like advanced people. Out of the two, I like this one better. I like how it dries black. I, I feel like it has a stronger and longer hold. Well, I don't know about long. I feel like it has a stronger hold. It feels more secure on my eyelid. This one has a strong hold too, but this one just feels more secure on my eyelid. And it dries down faster. Like when I put it on the lashes, it doesn't take too long for it to dry. I like that. And I just really like it. <clears throat> now for the lashes that I wear, I'm currently wearing my lashes right here. This is the packaging. This is for my summer collection. I've worn these lashes about 10 times. Um, so they're not like, they're not in the packaging, right? It has something that comes in here for the lashes to sit on. But the lashes that I'm using are my lashes from my lash line. It'll be linked in the description bar below. These are 25 millimeter lashes and they are very curly as well. As you can tell, I have some glue up here. I decided to use a pair that I've already worn because I feel like it's important for me to show you guys how to take off glue on your lashes. The easier way to do it is to soak them. But if you're like kind of like in a rush, this is how you do it. So first you want to hold on to the lashes tight. You want to get a pair of tweezers. And a lot of people make the mistake of when they, they grip on the glue, you can't really see it, but there's some glue up here. They pull it back. When they pull it back, they risk the they risk pulling hairs off just in case you might've gotten glue on the hair. So instead of pulling the lash back, you wanna grip on the glue and pull it to the side. You wanna take the glue and pull it to the side. Don't pull back, pull to the side. That's basically what I'm trying to say. Okay, now, now that I've got my glue out there from the last time I wore them, we're gonna need some mascara. Take any mascara of your choice. It don't matter, me personally. I'm gonna tell you right now, um, I don't see a difference. The only difference I see when I wear mascara and don't wear mascara is like that the lash kind of grips on better. And that's, I don't know how to explain it, but it's like the lashes just grip on better. 
they stay in place a little bit better. If I don't have mascara, it's not really a big deal, but that's just kind of the difference that I see. I really don't care if I wear mascara, if I don't wear mascara with it. It's just kind of, it depends on how I'm feeling that day. So I get my little meal and I apply some mascara. So I got some mascara. My lashes are trash, so. Mm. So I'm gonna let y'all know this right now. I don't use tweezers to put on my lashes. I honestly don't see how people can use tweezers to put on lashes. Like, it's it's so hard in my opinion. Like, I don't understand. Here's the glue I'm using. Here's the um lash, and we're just gonna apply the glue. Can you see? You're just gonna apply the glue only on the lash line. You do not want to make a mistake and get the glue on the actual lash hairs because that happens and then your glue starts to dry up and you need to take the glue off, you're gonna pull some hairs out. So now right here, you see, I got the glue. I got the glue up here. It's gray right now. It dries black. Um, People say wait 30 seconds. I feel like it takes me longer than 30 seconds. Maybe it's just me. I don't know, I blow on it. All right, now it should, it's drying. It should be almost done. You're gonna need a, need a mirror. I, I recommend a mirror that kind of does this. So this is what's gonna happen. I'm gonna take my mirror, right? It's like this right now. I'm gonna do it like this and put my head below the mirror. When you're sitting like this, you can see, like you can just see your lash line better opposed to if you're like this and you're trying to do, it's just, you can't see. You get like an underneath view and it's easier, so. You're going to want to hold the lash in the middle, like perfectly in the middle. You want to hold it tight. The first thing you're going to do, you're going to look down in your mirror and you're going to, I swear, y'all going to hate me for saying this, but you're going to pop them on. Like people are like, if it was just the easiest to pop them on, I wouldn't be watching this video. It's like you really just, you, okay. <laughs> your lashes, your real lashes, you're just going to sit them on it. So what I mean by that, you're going to sit them down and push you're gonna push. Now you wanna get that middle down first. Once you got your middle down, you wanna come to the corner. You just wanna push that back. And when you come to the end of the corner, you wanna push that back. If you got that middle down perfect, all you gotta do is push the other ends down. Push them like, push them into your eyelid, kind of. If you can't tell by now, I'm not good at tutorials. My look, it took literally five seconds. The lashes on. Voila. I'm sorry if I did not explain good. I'm sorry if something wasn't. This is just exactly how I do it, honestly. It takes me five seconds. Now, just, just you know, to show you again how to do it, I'm going to go get the next one. We want to put the glue on the lash band. Okay, so do the same way. You got your mirror. Set it below you. Right here, you want to set your center. You want to hold on to the center of it. You want to set that center of this lash to the center of your lash. By the way, something I forgot to mention. You want to cut your lashes to the size of your eye, like the, the length of your eye. Now, my friend, she likes a shorter lash. I like a longer lash. These lashes, I have not, I did not cut to the length of my eye. I kept them long. So, that's something else you want to do. You want to make sure you cut them the right length of your eye. I would suggest just from like right here to like to the end. That's my opinion. But honestly, that kind of, that's kind of up to you, honestly. I don't really think a tutorial is a, it's not I don't think a tutorial is needed for that. Maybe it's just me. You gonna set you wanna make sure you have the exact middle of that lash. And you wanna push it. Once you you want the the glue still feels a little wet. I like my glue to still feel a little wet when I put it on. I don't care. A lot of people say your glue shouldn't be wet, who knows? Once you feel that wetness touch, push it in. You just gonna push it in. So I have my lashes on. This is basically it. I'm so sorry if this was a trash tutorial. I'm sorry if I did not explain good. Honestly, I tried to explain the best of my ability. If it didn't work out, I'm sorry. <laughs> but um yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope this got this video helped you guys i'm sorry if it didn't i really try my best um yeah <laughs> if you like this video make sure you like put a give a thumb 
If you like this video, please make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you like me and you want to see more of my videos, please subscribe. Please turn on my post notifications. And also leave down there in the comments what type of videos y'all want to see. Because, you know, I'm going to give them to you. By the way, if you guys haven't realized, my new scheduling upload thingy, my bob, whatever you call it, is Wednesdays and Sundays now. It used to just be Sundays, but I'm doing Wednesdays and Sundays because, you know, I'm coming full force. <laughs> but I just hope y'all enjoyed this tutorial. I hope it was a good tutorial. I don't know. I hope it was. Was it a good tutorial? Hmm? Let me know. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Bye.